Uh, tonight we're going to take a look at near infrared reflectivity. Uh, sometimes you hear on uh, clothing uh, that it's IR coated or IR treated. So we're going to take a look at what that means with a full moon shining on the uh, piece of clothing and reflecting the near infrared light. So first up we've got the so-called night vision camouflage uh, from the Desert Storm era. Uh, this is the grid pattern, the square green and black clothing sometimes you see in the Army Navy stores. Okay, so you see it's, it's not really camouflaging anything right now. Pretty nice. Pretty good job. Uh, there's a lot of things said about the ACU pattern. Uh, in general, I like it very much, though. I think it's uh, very versatile and uh, very well thought out. Usually commercial fabric is a lot darker than the surroundings, but it looks here like this particular brand has got acceptable uh, infrared reflectivity. Uh, matches the IR reflectivity of the plants around it. Okay, here we're looking at the U.S. Marine Corps MARPAT camouflage. Notice how dark it is compared to the surrounding vegetation. Certainly it's a lot better. You see it, it not quite as dark as the other camouflage and it's almost the same brightness as the surroundings so that is very desirable. All right, now we're going to take a look at the Eagle Patrol Pack. It's a 72-hour backpack.
Next up we have True Spec Pants. Okay, this is the Desert Storm Camouflage Pattern. It's called the Six Color Chocolate Chip Pattern. Web Gear, Nylon Web Gear from Eagle Industries. And lastly, guys, uh, Commercial Paint, Mil-Spec Parkerizing, and a nylon sling.